He, yeah, he's switching out. All right, then I'll switch out then. That's fine. You guys can go. Did it just start? What's going on here? Yeah. Oh, they started. Oh. Look at that. All right, what's going on, guys? Okay. It's Goffin in here joining uh, Koopa. What's going on, man? Yeah, they started pretty quick. I thought we were going to have a little break before top eight. Oh, it looks like they're... Oh, this is a button check. Oh, is it? Okay, look at that. Or maybe it wasn't a button check. Okay, no, it wasn't a button check. Regardless, we got that break in the action we needed. Yeah. Needless to say, folks, we got uh, we got the great Gonzalez going up against Jackal here. Yeah, Jackal's been doing pretty well. I think he, he got out. I mean, he got into lose a, a little earlier than he would have wanted to. Yeah, he lost a round before quarters of Jack. Uh -huh. uh, but Jack obviously making top eight, mm -hmm. so he was on a, a tear of himself. Yeah, Jack doing really right well, now. man. So see how this works out. Gons was playing Palutena earlier when I saw him on stream. Now rocking the nest against Pikachu, mm -hmm. or Pichu in this case. Can't really yeah. say it's a bad idea. Pichu and, and uh, Pikachu uh, both seem to struggle oh with characters like Ness. Yeah. Jeez. And uh, he pur he purposely uh, kind of like tippered that back air so he can fall out and just get caught by the uh, the F2. That was, that was so good. Yeah, dude, that was crazy. Ooh, there we go. Mm. Good read on the air dodge right there. Yeah, a lot of people think that's safe. But once you air dodge to the uh, to the edge like that, you have a lot of like frames where you're just vulnerable. So yeah. if, you, if somebody could throw out a media hitbox, <laughs> you get hit. God, I can't believe you just got hit by that. I can. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I actually learned that Ness's up smash has the same like charging like hitbox animation that yes. uh, down smash does. Yeah, I learned that pretty late into launch as well. Yeah. It was like three weeks, three or four weeks after, and I'm like, like, wait a minute. Yeah, like how do you walk the dog like vertically? <laughs> like, excuse me. Needless to say, uh, Jackal continuing to press his lead right here. Mm -hmm. Like the hard part for Gons here has just been—he's been having a horrible time getting out of like the ledge area. Yeah, and that's—I mean—that's what most characters in this game. It's pretty hard to um, to get off the ledge. You take a lot of damage trying to get off the ledge, and that yeah, your triple jump is not going to work here, Gons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. Uh, I was a big fan of that thunder jolt right there. It forced Gons to air dodge like a little lower than he probably would have liked to. Yep. It might have been a better idea just to take the uh, B. I mean, hindsight is always 20, 20 but that down smash B. I walk the dog on the edge. And the dog bites. And the dog <laughs> bites. <laughs> that was a fantastic attempt right there from uh, from Gons. Continuing to press right now. He's, a, he's even things up for the most part. Yeah, now definitely. has himself in the lead. Yeah, that was a great re-grab on, uh, on the platform just now. He could have threw out an air, which would have gotten blocked. But he opted to just uh, press his advantage and get the grab. Ooh, you see uh, excuse me, Jackal going for the home run right there. It looks like back going to uh, shield poke. And I'm, oh, that was dangerous, but it uh, worked out in his favor. Yeah, Gons has been kind of like poking his hurtbox ever so slightly through the edge. Jeez, And man. that's so good, because Pikachu has no hitbox on, on the up B. Yeah. So you just got deleted. <laughs> you, know, you, you know, you can tell the difference, because Pikachu's up B is called Quick Attack, which uh -huh. obviously has the name Attack in it. Pichu's up B is Agility. Agility does not have mm. is that an attacking move in Pokemon, so... There you go. But it's always been something like that's like really, really good uh, for Ness against you know Pikachu, Pikachu in Smash Four is that Ness has these huge hitboxes uh, that Pikachu just can't like ever so you know kite around and yeah. especially for Pichu because there isn't a hitbox on that move. So and then needless to say, really good job there from Gons. Uh, Jackal's in the driver's seat for a large majority of that game. So, but here we go. They're out there, uh, we're at PS one. Uh, yes, we are. You can tell because, um, A, the, the platforms are a lot lined in black, and they don't have, like, the, the three screens on the side of the big screen back yeah. there. It's a giant CRT in the back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Am I the only one that, like, gets distracted by that screen? You are going to die. Sheesh. I mean, your B is pretty big. Don't get me wrong, <laughs> Pichu. I mean, you're, you're, you're down there is pretty big. But this is Ness's up B you tried to contest after the fact. Yeah. Oh, well, needless to say, it gets the job. And even Gonz is like, okay. Yeah. Well played, worthy adversary. If at first, you don't succeed. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> Roll back and try it again. But I need you to answer one question. Why does that move kill at the bottom and at the, at the side? You I don't either know, get man. spiked or you just explode to the blast zone. Dude, I don't know, man. But I, also, I for one, welcome our new top tier baby Pokemon <laughs> for sure. But needless to say. Yeah. Beat uh, you so good, man. <laughs> he looks so cute. Come on, man. You can't be mad at him. His head's bigger than his body. He I already can, has problems. I can absolutely be mad at people. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> all right, goes for the forward throw, mostly for positioning's sake. Absolutely. Gon Gons recovers high, and it looks like he's all out of resources. Yep. So how do you get back on stage? He's going to up B. Oh, no. He's just not even doesn't. to up B. 
just says forget it. I yeah. don't want to lose. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like he like thought he had a jump left still. He probably thought he like hit the ground before he got hit again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was weird. His reaction time is, is pretty good though. So I'm Whoa! Oh, that sucks. Jackal almost exploded. <laughs> he almost exploded. <laughs> okay, yeah. down throw. Yep, forward air. That combo both worked for Pikachu in Smash 4 and also worked well mm -hmm. for Pikachu in this game. Okay, now he's just going to press his advance. He's going to get another grab. It's a back air. Going to put him off stage. How does Gans get back to the stage? He's taking a lot of damage on his last stock here. Yeah, that was a good air dodge right there from Gans. He's been, I think he used the air dodge like upwards yeah. to like hit the ledge, but you there mean, he did it to just land behind him. You mean the triple jump? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like oh that. God. There you go. That is legit. His air dodge goes higher than Snake's uh, grounded jump. I am not even like. <laughs> oh, God, the visualization of Pichu's F tilt is the most disgusting thing I've seen in my entire oh life. Oh my God! The um, you saw the the hitbox? Yeah, <laughs> dude, why does his feet? Why does his yo, feet do that? Yo, it, it looks really weird. He lifts both legs, and first of all, the first leg like protrudes like clay. <laughs> it just looks like odd. Like I don't want to look at that. Like, does he have toes, or is it just one big foot? Like I don't get it. <laughs> Like the, the or just one, like, ham hock leg. <laughs> <laughs> the anatomy of Pichu. I, I need, like, science to, like, to, like tell me what's going on here because I got nothing. Word. So game three. Uh, Gon's evening up the set count. I like it. Um, but Jackal, I think that he's not pressing any buttons in the beginning of this match. No, without a doubt. Mm -hmm. But Gon's off to a quick start right here. Like, both these guys are going to make their money, like, edge guarding the others. It's a... Uh, <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> so he's gonna just gonna land with a nair, and then um, gonna press his advantage off stage. He clipped his jump just now, but wasn't in position to punish him for it. Yeah, it looks like both these guys are just opting for the same strategy, like I was saying. Ooh, okay. See, that would have like been spelt doom for most other characters because there's like no hits done on um, when you get hit by like the charging hitbox of down smash. Yeah. But because Pichu's recovery is so good, he was able to live to see another day. But reverse nair out of shield. Still gets the job done, so Gans finds himself in an early advantage right now. Yeah, you see Jackal, he kind of woke up with some buttons when he got off the ledge. So Gans was able to just nair out of shield. That nair is still great. He's probably even better in this game than it was in Smash 4. Oh, yeah, especially because, like, I, know, I feel like most characters, like, edge guarding, like, juggle tools are, like, much better than they are in this game than they are in other games. Mm -hmm. Because, like, air dodges are far more committal. Yeah. And that's just, like, a character you can just kind of, like, air dodge for free to get back down to the stage. Yeah, exactly kind of mash it out. So now yeah. you got to be selective with your air dodge. Gets it right there, and the F-tilt will meet its mark. So yep. Jackal even things up here. Finds himself at a slight uh, percent deficit, but it is Pichu. So yeah. that's definitely death percent right now. Okay. He got hit with the... Oh, he's not going to die. 116. I would have... That was great DI. Because yeah. I would have bet the form on that one that he was going to take a stock. Yeah, me too, man. Like I said, Pichu is the lightest character in the game. So, yeah. like, by far. Pretty light. Rightfully so, it's a baby. Babies aren't that heavy. You should know that. You have like three of them. I have three babies. <laughs> All three of them. But they don't hurt themselves. Yeah. Um, <laughs> they, don't, they don't protrude electricity from their body. At hopefully. all. But they do do a lot of damage. Nonetheless, back here, gonna put uh, gonna put Gons off stage. 95% on his second stock. He's looking pretty good right now. Any extra credit on Pichu is, is definitely great. Oh, Pichu, yeah, without Pichu, a doubt, man. Yeah, Pichu dying really early. Uh, so if you can secure that stock, even with the rage, it's definitely doing him some favors. Down smash actually proven to be a good spacing tool right there. Jack wasn't able to run forward and grab guns. Mm -hmm. And the longer that he lets this, this stock uh, ride out here, uh, the harder it's going to be for him to come back. Mm, and that was some next level Yomi. Oh, down smash. The active hitboxes on that move could do your taxes. They, they, they can do just everything. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah. many active hitboxes. Yeah, if y'all need an accountant before tax season's over, mm -hmm. definitely look at check out that guy. Okay, here we go. Yeah, and you see Jack, uh, Jack will bring this one back. Pretty yeah, much it, even percentages yeah. before Gons uh, took that in, but you are dead. Oh, wow, he got, yeah, he got the... At the edge, yo. Jackal DI, make Woo. a video. <laughs> that was crazy, man. There's two, that's two back throws that he survived. Yeah. He definitely should have been dead. Absolutely should have died. Maybe the blast one's a PS1 proven to be a little bit... Uh, Lenient there. Ooh. Mm. Now you see Jackal doing a really good job. He understands that Ness's air dodge drift is great, so he's opting to wait out the air dodge and try and uh, get him right before he hits the ground. Oh, he gets the forward smash, and it's enough. Yep, gonna do it. I don't All know right. if that shield poked or if he just tried no, to come he, out. Or I think he dropped. He just dropped shield. Yeah. Like he ran into it. Oh God, he's so cute. 
<laughs> I, I just can't handle it, man. Nah, man, I can handle it. <laughs> <laughs> I hate Pichu, man. <laughs> Pichu's, a, Pichu's, Pichu's a jerk. Yo, know, Pichu, the I, the correlation I make from Pichu, he's like a, a bullet. Super small, but like does all the damage in the world. Like, you can't catch a yeah, bullet. He's a bullet from like a Matrix movie or something. <laughs> Like, when Neo does the dodging thing, that's what Pichu is. Yeah, no, but Pichu's the bullet that actually hit him the, the time that he couldn't, that he didn't <laughs> do it right. <laughs> that's Pichu. Pichu's that bullet. Okay. Nonetheless, um, I have to go right back to PS1. Uh, they like the stage. Uh, they don't feel like the stage is, uh, yeah, the the stage stage is doing too much. Yeah, the stage rocks. Mm -hmm. This is like the super starter. This is more of a starter than Smashville was. <laughs> and you see... The, the screen in the back, it always gives me, like, this weird, like, vibe. It, it kind of tricks me out oh, when dude, I see no, it. It looks funnier weird. on PS2 because, like, you ever been to, like, a pizzeria that has, like, all the mirrors in the back? Yeah. And you can just, like, look into forever okay, with it? Okay, you're not surviving now. Yeah. <laughs> no. All right, so Gon's striking first here, trying to push you to a game five. Jackal trying to move on uh, to winner semifinals. Or it's losers, uh, quarters, excuse me. Okay, Fair going to put him off stage. Gon's doing a really good job. He had in pretty much control of this match. Yeah, this is where he can kind of can like sit back and just like not play the game. Good air dodge right there. Jackal yep. just missed facing the, the S smash punish. Yep, that the length on that air dodge really getting guys out of some trouble. Ooh. How do you get back to the stage? He's gonna up be high. Oh, Jackal Ooh. missing the punish. Jackal probably thought he was gonna re recover at a steeper angle than what he did. And I like that. You see Jackal on his way back to the stage. He's opting not to air dodge, but he's trying to hit the up B with um with down air. Right. That down air, really big hitbox, so uh, that'll cancel it, it out, and he'll be able to save his jump. I mean, his air dodge. Yep. Goes for the back air. Stalls himself with the uh, the thunder cloud. And get up attack really good in this game. A lot of people aren't really using it the yeah. way that they should. Get up attack is invincible throughout the entire thing. So. Yeah, that's crazy, man. Thank God. <laughs> yeah, right? Get, oh, back air going to seal it. Get up attack was so bad in Smash 4. Oh, yeah. Get up attack has always been, like, the red-headed stepchild of, like, ledge options <laughs> yeah. for the longest time. Like, it, it's still bad, but, like, at least it's, like, better. Yeah. I mean, it's it's actually an option now. Yeah. Before, it was just, like, a supreme mix-up. I haven't done this in nine sets. <laughs> I'm just going to do it now. All right. So, Jackal just desperately trying to get the stock off right now. Okay. Mm, Gon's doing a good job of just putting hitboxes out on the edge. Pichu at 54%, but I mean, back air full rage, that'll do some damage at the edge, especially right now. Really gets the forward air. Yes, yeah, not, not going to kill yet. Yeah. There we go. I don't know if he would have been able to take that even if he, like, timed it correctly. Yeah, that I couldn't, I couldn't tell if there was red splashes there or not. So That was a lot of knockback. Down smash, and you're dead. Weirdness. Tying it up. Game five. Yeah, man. This has Game been a good set so far. Yeah. They, this is only the first one of our top eight mm -hmm. so far. And they're, bra they're really brawling it out. They're going back and forth. Is that you, you could um, neither one is really like supremely in control. One is just kind of winning, and then the other one wins. So, oh yeah, dude, without a doubt, this game five is gonna be uh, one to watch. I'd like to see Gans uh, maybe uh, be a little more mix it up a little bit with his air dodges. He's kind of just air dodging and yep. drifting as far as he can. Uh, if Jackal could pick up on that, he could pick up some early stocks with with uh, four two. Yeah, man, without a doubt. <laughs> <laughs> He was coming for the knees immediately. That was so ratchet. I'm just going to forward smash your shield real quick. <laughs> Excuse me while I forward smash. Yeah, I'm saying, though. Jeez. <laughs> All right, so Jackal off to the strong start right now, or the early start. See him trying to go for a jab block right there, but mm. God's having a good uh, wear it all to tech uh, after that low forward there. Mm -hmm. And the thing about Pikachu uh, Thunder Jolt, you can't really contest it if you allow Pichu to send it while uh, Pichu's moving forward. Yep. Because um, even if you parry it, Pichu's not getting, oh, forward smash going to kill from right there. Absolutely. You can't, really, you can't really contest it because Pikachu's following it with buttons. You have to contest it on the way, uh, on Pichu's way out, on the startup frame, because it has a lot, uh, pretty much a lot of end lag, enough to punish it. Yeah, man, for sure. So Gon is going to have to get, get up there early. Maybe use, his, uh, use a full hop, fair. Yeah, it's weird. Like characters that can kind of like, uh, like walk with their own projectiles, like villager, like side beat. Yeah. Like and stuff like that. It's just another like layer for mm -hmm. you to like, you know, stay on top of. Exactly. 
because now they're covering space, like they're covering a moving space, and then they could cover your your defensive option. Right, oh. good. Yeah, that was a good weight right there uh, on the ledge from Jackal. Mm -hmm. And now Jackal's the one that's continuing to press this lead uh, to potentially the point of no return. Okay, back, back <laughs> throw, gonna do it. Didn't even need the mix up. <laughs> just fling you right over here. <laughs> <Just vanished. laughs> <laughs> so I love that so much. All right, so that was huge for Gans, like, because at least now it's like a damage deficit and not like a huge stock deficit. Because mm -hmm. like when you're down three socks to one, it's really hard to like mount those comebacks. Yeah. And you see Gans on his way back to the stage. I just noticed he's um he's opting to go high a lot, which is smart. You'll take an up air from Pikachu, but uh, at least you'll be above the stage and you could kind of mix it up a little bit instead of air dodging immediately as you approach the stage. Yeah, he's and very he's being very fluent with his, his how he yeah. gets back to the stage. Mm. Like he's opting for low recoveries, but he's also like mixing in the high recoveries as well, like you were saying. Yeah, gets the up throw, uh, but not gonna get the thunder confirm out of it. Okay, so you see two kind of just whiffing moves out here, throwing moves in the hitbox. Nice DI on that uh, on that up throw. Yeah, if you just DI like left or right, you're more likely than not not gonna get hit by the yeah. thunder cloud. At least out of at least out of percent for it's not like a true combo. Oh my gosh, and dash attack below 90 <laughs> almost did it did teach you in. Yeah, that's oh, gonna do. Oh, there it. we go. Goodbye. So Gans finds himself in the lead right now. Jackal uh, trying to press. Okay. Now, uh, you can see Gantz, he's really comfortable now. He's uh, he's understanding Jackal's shield patterns, and you can see he mixed it up just now with a grab. Um, it's not a good place to be in for, for Jackal. He's going to have to adapt if he wants to take this uh, take this stock. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Reads the high recovery with nice. the back air. Last stock for, uh, game for us here, folks. Yeah, and like we said, Jackal was able to adapt. We just noticed that Gantz was opting to go high his last couple of attempts coming back to the stage. Jackal immediately picked up on it and got that back air to seal the stock. Now, this isn't far out of the realm of possibility. He's only 50, he only has 56%, and Pikachu, Pichu does damage. Yeah, man, for sure. Yeah, and Jackal just having a hard time landing on the stage right now. Finally finds that, uh, that hit that he needs. Mm -hmm. Continues to string with the back air. Okay, so you know what he, you know what Gans is waiting for now. He's going to throw out some buttons, make you think that you can punish, and then he's going to go Ooh, for that, that back Ooh, that could have been super scary. Jeez. Yeah. All right, connects with the back air again. Yep. So has his jump, gonna use his jump high. Air dodge to the platform, yeah. but he's there. He's back on stage. Yeah, Jackal's just doing a better job just like sharking underneath Gans when he like recovers high like that. He's like, uh, there's literally nothing he can like throw out that's like unreactable at that height. Nice, gonna cancel <laughs> out that thunder. Oh. That's so scary, man. The up air and connects. Up nice, go. gonna do it. So Jackal falling out at seventh place here for the great Gonzalez. Yeah. Moving on in the losers. Yep. And you can see Gans, he understood he had a uh, great advantage just now. And um, Jackal just wanted to get off that platform. And it looked like he buffered an air dodge yeah. on that jump. So that kind of that kind of put him in that uh, lag that he wasn't able to do anything. He couldn't throw out an aerial, couldn't air dodge again. 